With a bit of knowledge in mechanics and a lot of fantasy, a Brazilian civil servant has created, in his garage in Sao Paulo, what he calls the Moto Power H2O. Ricardo Azevedo has transformed his 1993 Honda NX200 into a kind of water-powered motorcycle. The bike uses a car battery to produce electricity. This device breaks apart the water molecules, transforming it into oxygen and hydrogen. The hydrogen comes out in larger quantities, and then I use this hydrogen to run the motorcycle engine. Six months since the launch of his concept motorbike, with added tests and improvements, Azevedo believes his project can help in the reduction of pollution. Instead of carbon monoxide coming out of the exhaust pipe, it's water vapor. This motorcycle is run on hydrogen taken from water. And in a hybrid test I did, it travels over 500 kilometers per liter of water. To trial his homemade technology, the Brazilian inventor used different kinds of water, such as distilled and drinkable water, and even water from a local polluted river. And amazingly, the result did not change. Every sort of, of new device, of, of any work, has to be considered with every respect. I mean, I, I have all respect to the sort of people that, out of concern, start to, to, to tinkering uh, with the things they have at home, and they came up with something that works. The university professor appreciates Azevedo's straightforward and simple concept. The only thing is that we need to inform the public that there's no magic bullet to solve the energy crisis. I mean, what is happening is an electric vehicle. It's not, run, it's not running on water. It's running on electricity on the battery. But we need to, to, to command the efforts of everyone at home that is concerned. And maybe we need to, 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 to provide help so they can fully develop the vehicle. Hydrogen is the most abundant element in our universe. However, on the Earth's surface, pure hydrogen is rare because it is too light. We usually see hydrogen bound together with other types of atoms, as it commonly happens with oxygen into the water. Research into hydrogen combustion power has increased over the past few years, and several car makers are keen to release vehicles based on this principle. I also did the experiment with the polluted water from the Tieta River. And to my surprise, the polluted water from the river worked as much as the ideal water. So now I use the polluted water as fuel in my motorcycle. While not run directly on water, the Moto Power H2O is heading in the right direction. However, the potential market is still curbed until a way to safely contain and use the flammable hydrogen gas is fully developed.